The greatest increase in demand for energy is predicted to come from the world where, with rapid urbanization, large scale electricity generation will be required. With environmental requirements for minimum CO2 emission and the need to invest in sustainable energy, new energy sources must be developed. The artificial sun is designed to replicate the fusion process that occurs in the sun. Fusion is seen as a solution for energy issues as it is clean, sustainable, and healthy. Deep inside the sun, hydrogen fuses together at temperatures of around 15 million degrees Celsius. The concept of artificial sun is actually the replication of nuclear fusion process in the sun. In order to replicate this process on Earth, gases need to be heated to extremely high temperature of about 150 million degrees Celsius, whereby atoms become completely ionized. The fusion reaction that is easiest to accomplish is the reaction between two hydrogen isotopes, deuterium attracted from water and tritium produced from during the fusion reactions through contact with lithium. When deuterium and tritium nuclei fuse, they form a helium nucleus, a neutron and a lot of energy. The artificial sun must be able to produce temperature 10 times higher than those in the sun. To reach this temperature, there must be powerful heating, and thermal losses must be minimized by keeping the hot fuel particles away from the walls of the container. This is achieved by creating a magnetic cage made by strong magnetic fields which prevents the particles from escaping. For energy production, this plasma has to be confined for a sufficiently long period for fusion. To wrap things up, although it takes a few more years to have a fully functional artificial sun, it promises a far greater world to live in. This reactor creates a lot of energy with only a small environmental impact. In November 2018, China produces 100 million watts, which is equivalent to lighting up 200,000 light bulbs. It also produces no nuclear waste, carbon free, and efficient. The fuel is also has a million, has million years of supply. This endeavor will promise an emission free world and a self-sustaining planet. In a nutshell, energy related to nuclear is considered dangerous and given less attention. So as a chemical engineer, it is our role to exploit it for a sustainable world as it is more for the sake.